it may seem like nuts and bolts are needed to complete your internal setup activities. In this lecture, we will dig into a few of Shigeo Shingo's legendary tips from the book A Revolution in Manufacturing, the SMED System. Nuts and bolts are cheap. You can get them everywhere. They hold items on and do the trick. With a few exceptions, of course. They take time to install, they get lost, they are mismatched, they can get stuck, and every turn except the last one is waste. As we learned earlier in the course, the purpose of a nut, bolt, or any attaching device is to secure and unfasten. This means that if a bolt has 10 threads on it, nine of the turns it takes to securely fasten the bolt are waste, and only the first or the last is actually needed. The reduce methodology borrows from SMED with functional clamping systems and devices, instead of nuts and bolts. These devices not only save wasted time and energy, but they also can be custom made and attached to machines or information flow so that tooling, materials, and information do not get lost. There are three main functional clamping systems that we will introduce in this lecture. One turn methods, single motion methods, and interlocking methods. One turn methods, as the name implies, seek to eliminate the over-processing that is inherent in many nuts and bolts and screws by creating a one turn item. This is the single motion items these items require one motion to secure an item, such as a switch that is flipped or a button that is pushed. The final functional clamping method is the interlocking devices. These items generally slide into place to secure items. As you can tell, these three options are great alternatives to the long process of finding nuts and bolts acquiring tools, and laboriously securing them during internal activities. You can find more details about these functional clamping devices and methods in the handouts of your course materials. See you in the next lecture.